Hey everyone, Shadow here, and welcome to another Marvel Contest of Champions video. So it's season 35, and this is war number six. And we're going up against an alliance called Indian Legacy. All right, let's first see who they banned. All right, Hercules, Human Torch, and Ghost. So they didn't ban my Spider-Man 2099, but we'll see if we bring him in. Uh, let's take a look at what they have set up. All right. Oh, we got a man thing on that node. Ugh. He is really a pain on that node. Really, really a pain. Uh, I've tried a couple of different um, opponents for him, but um, we'll see. I got to plan that out because it looks like my uh, alliance mate here is not wanting to tackle that when I don't blame him. And we can see why they got rid of Human Torch. Uh, Claire can and Doom can, but I usually die. Usually end up giving up a, a attack bonus doing that. Uh, nobody on my first node, so uh, that Emma, not a problem there. The middle is already cleared. It's looking good there. All right. And we've got Guardian. Um, if I brought... Yeah, if I brought um, Nick Fury, I could do that fight. Yeah, I could do that fight. Um, Hulk Buster. Claire. Um, Black Widow, Deadly Origin. Claire can do that one as well. Sasquatch. Hmm. On that node, um, Warlock can do that fight. Uh, what's their uh, mystic dispersion? Hmm. Okay. But yeah, Warlock should be able to do that fight. Ooh, we got Doctor Doom as the boss. And since they didn't ban Spider-Man 2099, uh, that's a wrap. Our boss killer can bring in Spider-Man 2099 and take that fight pretty easily. So, hmm. I'm honestly not sure. Uh, definitely bring in Claire. And definitely want to bring... Well, if I'm going to be taking... Yeah. If I take man thing. Hmm. So Claire, Nick Fury and Warlock unless I need to bring someone in for that man thing. And we'll see. I, I don't know who's great for him to be honest with you. Uh so we'll see. We'll see what we do there. But Claire is definitely coming in, and I think Warlock will definitely come in, and Nick Fury, we'll see, because Nick is not really needed, so I might bring in a, a counter for that man thing. All right, let's get to the fighting. Okay, we are back, and let me warn you guys this is going to be a bloodbath you're going to see me die more than you have ever seen me die in a single war but i did it with permission all right but anyway so first fight is going to be against emma frost not too worried about emma frost okay um she's she used to be very difficult but over time, we've gotten used to her. Uh, the only trick sometimes is if she's not awakened, you have to remember not to reverse your controls. Uh, that's about it. Or you could just block. Uh, it doesn't do a lot of damage. But she's awakened, which means uh, her specials will reverse your controls. And so I'm used to it because that's how I first learned how to fight her. All right. So we're just going in. Not, not too bad here. All right, now I want to bait that out. There we go. 
And I blocked the first one and then evaded the second one. And then this time I block I evaded both of them. Um just to give me a little bit of time to kind of get used to it. Okay, see? Once I once I'm like, okay, okay, I got it. Then we're good. But that first one I wanted to block to give me time to reprogram my brain uh kind of all right so now this mini is man thing you see man thing on this node a lot and so we started talking about how best to deal with man thing on this node we have to come up with a solution right now i've done a few fights with him i've done doom uh, my Doom wasn't ranked up, but Doom, I died once, uh, but we got Man-Thing down. Um, Claire, same thing, one death, but I'm trying to find a good solution. So I looked around, people were saying, well, she's good, all right? Nebula is good uh, for this. Now, the videos that I watched, they, they were... Um, with man thing having unstoppable armor okay uh not mystic dispersion so as you see here i'm just trying to build her up but she's taking so much damage because he's getting a lot of furies and then look at that i'm just like what the heck? look at this, just bashing me bashing me i'm like all right now i'm trying to parry to get the um like the uh shocks on him but I'm also trying to wait out, and it's just a mess. There's too much going on right there to for me to have to worry about getting the right one. There's masochism. I, I parry at the wrong time. Masochism eats up her entire thing, which makes all of what I did useless. So all that time I spent trying to build up, and look at what happened. So Nebula can do it. This was my first time going in. Now, I asked for permission. Uh, we were doing very well in war. So I asked for permission to just keep trying and learning. Okay, that was the only point uh, in doing this. I wanted another try. I had, I had gone in and I just wanted to learn this fight because it would help us later. You know, if I can get that fight down with Nebula, then I'll have it. Okay, so we knew we were going to die, but we wanted to get as much practice in. I clicked that by accident. Don't don't look at me. Um, but anyway, so I did talk with my alliance first, and they were like, "Yep, go ahead," uh, because it's a it's a difficult uh, fight, but there are solutions. Okay, um, this was the first attempt that we had at a solution, which was Nebula. And if you'll notice here, my Nebula. Something flying around here. Uh, my Nebula is not ranked up to three yet in this video. If you watched uh, my previous rank up videos, you know that I eventually took her to rank three. And she would have done much better. You know, she would have taken less damage in her block, I believe, uh, at rank three. All right. But so see here, you see me doing this here. And I'm like, all right. You know, I, I think I got what I need to do. All right. So we're still doing this. We're still building up evading his heavies, which are easy to evade. Now I need to unload this and I messed up the timing there because I need to fire a heavy off, okay? I need to fire a heavy off to eat up the masochism and then I can do what I need to do, all right? So here we go, heavy, okay? We got that, now parry, come on, parry. There we go, got the shock. I fired off my special two and it got eaten up because of the timing that it just drives me crazy. Now that time that should have been the perfect fight. But when I fired the special two off already had the shock on when I went to do the, the, you know, extra double, that's when the masochism had come back around and ate up the rest of that so that I ended up not doing a whole lot of damage. So here I am trying to do it again. All right. And then that's mystic dispersion kicked in right there. And so I'm like, oh boy, now what do I do? I'm in the corner again. 
All right, so here it is. I'm trying not to parry because I don't want to unload the, the shock by mistake, you know, at the wrong time. All right, just so much I'm having to try and keep track of here. All right, so here we go. I'm gonna try it again. All right, need to fire off a heavy or something like that. All right, so here we go. Boom. What was that? Don't know. Okay, get the, the shock purified and I'm dead. All right, so I'm just like, wow. So I've seen Nebula do this fight. That ain't for me. I'll tell you that right now. I'm not the biggest fan of Nebula's play style anyway. And on that node, there's just too much. Too much that I have to get just right. When I watched and I looked back on it, first of all, they were doing unstoppable armor, which is a little bit easier to deal with than that mystic dispersion thing. And because that messed me up towards the end. So you have to deal with all the node mess. Then you have to deal with man things mess. And then you have to try to get the timing right for Nebula. No, it's just, it's just too much. But at this time, I'm learning this. So it's still valuable, even though you see me dying over and over. You see, I'm sitting here because I'm talking with my alliance. And I'm just like, okay, you know, we're probably not going to have any um, attack bonus on this one, but I'm willing to keep trying so that I can learn the fight. Well, what I learned is that I'm not fighting with Nebula on that node when, uh, especially if it's Mystic Dispersion. There's just too much, too much for me to deal with. And there's better solutions. I would rather go in with Doom or Claire. Okay. Much rather do that. All right. So all this time I'm talking over, talking to my alliance, saying, okay, you know, there's too much going on. Basically what I've been telling you is what I was telling them. You know, I was like, and I had it, but, and then I was telling them what messed up that time. There's always something, you know, got the timing just a little bit wrong because if I had gotten the special two, and masochism was still on cooldown, we would have probably won this fight. But that's not what happened. So any little thing that's off seems to, to mess you up completely, at least with me and Nebula. Somebody else can do it. Um, but we did talk about this um, after this war uh, to come up with a better solution and we did. So, first of all, when I see Man Thing on here, I'm going to bring in um, White Mags. And I'm going to put the pre fight on that Man Thing. Then my Alliance mate is going to bring in a counter. And the White Mags pre fight makes it just <clears throat> so much easier uh, to deal with. And. Um, uh, I think the first time he went in, uh, and we'll see that later, I think the first time he tried it, it was against Thing, uh, with Thing. and But his Thing wasn't uh, high SIG, so it didn't work out all that well. Uh, and I ended up having to finish it off uh, with Claire. But for this particular one, you know, I'm, I'm at this point, I'm asking them, all right, you know, I could just get him down with Claire. You know, we could have just done a a, a one shot, uh, not a one shot, but um, at least a two shot with Claire. Uh, I know Warlock is not the best for this node, um, but, you know, we're having a, a lot of discussion at this point. Uh, so that's why I wanted to make sure you guys understood. I didn't just rush in and die, because I mentioned that in the last war, uh, we had someone rushing in and just dying repeatedly on the same note. You know, they got angry and they wanted their revenge and they were like, no, and I've done that in the past. Not in this alliance, but I've done that in the past where I just got really, really ticked. And I'm just like, no, I'm gonna get him down 
No matter what it takes, I'm going to use up all my items. I'm going to get them down. Well, that's not a responsible way to play. It's not respectful to the other folks in your alliance. Um, so I was not about to just rush in and do that. I was going to talk it over. All right, here we go. Finally, after all of that talking, uh, I said, all right, let's uh, go in again. And let's see, you know, we're not going to have any uh, attack bonus, but let's just get, you know, uh, get him down. Okay. And I looked again just to remind myself of what mystic dispersion actually does, um, because it's not one that, you know, I remembered all that well. Unstoppable armor, I saw all the time and I knew how to deal with that one. But mystic dispersion, not so much. All right. So uh, let me see. Who did I go in with? Because uh, it's been a little bit. Uh, since I did this war, um, I think I went in with Claire um, the next time, I believe. Oh, maybe I, I tried again. Yeah, okay. Guess I tried again. Hmm. Or did I make a mistake? and revive her. <laughs> I don't remember. At this point, we still have one attack bonus. I might have said, you know what? I'm going to go in one more time with her. And if this one doesn't work, forget about it. Um, but I wanted to, like I said, practice. And I, like I said, I, I don't really care for her play style. But... She can do the fight. I just don't think she is the best option for it. Now, here's the thing. What if I had had a white mags pre-fight on him and went in with Nebula? I think that would have made a much, much easier fight. Because, because of masochism, when I would parry, um, or rather, I would have to try to uh, do the heavy attack, it probably would have been easier with um, doing it with Claire and uh, White Mags or uh, Nebula. I don't know. All right, so you see here, doing it again. You know, I'm still getting it. I'm just like, okay, let's just, we built it up straight, right? This is good, All right? Now we got to do a heavy attack to eat up the masochism. All right, boom. But he was unstoppable, boom. All right, here we go. Bam, masochism is on cooldown. Ha! Got the shock on him. All right. This time I didn't try to do the special two, as you notice. Purified again, but look at that. That went much better. Okay? That went much better. I believe that style might have done a much better job. Um, instead of me trying to get that special two to maximize the damage where it probably would have just killed him if I had gotten it right. You know, getting that one perfect shot. All right, so here we go. We're going to do it again. All right, boom, boom. And now that's Mystic Dispersion that got me there. That was Mystic Dispersion because I missed because of Mystic Dispersion. And I'm like, wow, okay. But now we got the Masochism still. All right, so here we go. Boom, purified, Masochism. And he did that. So now we're off. All right, we got the shock. But if I did the special two... I would have messed up, okay? And see, here it is. We, we, we did a good job there. If we hadn't had the Mystic uh, Dispersion on, we would have done a much better job. And then I just messed up on the special too. But we did much better, so we are learning. We're learning what works for us and what doesn't. So even though I did not have... Um, you know, a, a good run and we've lost all the attack bonus, I learned. I learned how to do that fight with Nebula that would work the best for me. Now, Mystic Dispersion tripped me up or else I probably could have finished that fight. Uh, and of course, this is a, a rank two Nebula at that time. I now have a rank three Nebula. So yeah, if I need to, I could probably do that fight much better now. All right, but anyway, so I go in here with uh, Claire. There's Mystic Dispersion again. 
that that uh, global messed me up right there. And I'm like, oh my goodness. This globalist is annoying with him. All right. He was almost dead. And look at this. And I'm like, well, okay, so what am I what am I doing now? All right, we'll block it. All right, good. And here we go. And I'm trying to get my in. All right. Because of mystic dispersion. All right. Look at look at my health. Look at my health. Gone. Just like that. That's the thing with Claire. If you don't finish that fight quick, it's going to eat away your health. And I'm like, are you kidding me? With just a little bit of health left, I still lost another of my champions. Like I said, it was going to be a bloodbath. I told you, you're going to see me die more than you've ever seen me die before in war. And so now I'm just like, you know, yeah, I could have uh, revived Nebula, but I was like, let me just give her a rest. Okay, let me give her a rest. She probably could have finished the fight off, but I'm just like, all right, let's go. I know Warlock, he's not the best option <clears throat> as I've learned in the past, but I'm still thinking, okay, we should be easy to uh, finish this off, but there's that Mystic Dispersion again. And I'm like, oh my goodness, seriously? I do not like that global. After this, I don't like that global. All right. I, it was just popping up on me and I'm just like, come on. We just need to finish him off. All right. So here we go. And done. So that was a long, long section one. Okay. About the longest that you will see. Oh my goodness. So finally, we got Man-Thing down. I did get valuable information, okay? I know now what I would need to do if I go back in there um, with Nebula, okay? Now, we finally get into section two. And I actually did this fight not at home. I was actually out uh waiting for my mom uh at the doctor and i was like you know what they're ready for me to do the fights and even though i'm not on my home wi-fi i was on um a hot spot in the area i was like let me do it now you already know after all those deaths i'm not looking to die again okay i've already died enough for one more i've died enough for several wars in this war, even though I did get some valuable information. All right, so now we get to fight Hulkbuster on this node. And we get Claire. Uh, I was asked, uh, cause someone was like, are you sure um, you could handle the rest of the power? I'm like, yes, I'm just gonna, um, you know, revive Claire and we're good. Okay, so boom, nice burst damage. Very easy. Just have to watch him because you blink and he'll hit you into your block and the fight will be over. He will hit you. You'll get so much damage and stun and he'll come over there and just wreck you. It's happened before, but not this time. Boom. And he's done. All right. So not too bad. Not too bad. Wasn't really uh, all that worried about uh, that particular fight. Um, let me see. What was the next fight? Next fight. Let me see. Who was it? Ah, um, Black Widow, Deadly Origin. So not worried about her as long as I don't let her catch me. Her damage is not, she doesn't have like big, big, big damage. So you're not going to see the big yellow numbers. But her damage, she has um, damage over time. So her damage is actually really good. I don't have her as a six star, and I want her as a six star. Um, one of these days I'll get her. But she's not on my most wanted list, but I would love to have her. And I would take her up because I like her damage. It's subtle, but it's vicious. All right. But Claire just wasted. Yeah, buddy. No problem there. Nice, smooth, and easy. 
So we're doing good uh, after that uh, whew, learning experience. I'm going to call it a learning experience because it wasn't really a debacle. Went in there kind of already knowing what was going on. All right. This fight, um, I believe I took this fight uh, as well. Um, because uh, Warlock is a good uh, counter for this particular node and for Sasquatch. He ain't healing nothing. Um, so boost up and do all that good stuff that I got to do. And uh, of course, I'm trying to make up for losing all the attack bonus on that first mini. So I don't want to lose any more attack bonuses. No more attack bonuses lost. All right, so that's why you see me uh, buffing up, boosting up, all that good stuff. All right, so what we want to do here, which is why I put on the advanced power boost, is parry, 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 get the infections up so that he can't um, heal, and then build up to that special two, which I can only do with the uh, attack uh, power boost, uh, advanced power boost. And then just keep on working him over. All right, here we go. And I won't be able to get to another um, special two. But that's fine. Might not even be able to get to a special one. There go that Mystic Dispersion again. And now he's in wrath. I'm like, oh no. Uh, big boy. Easy now. Easy big boy. And I'm just trying to wait out that wrath. I could um, par uh, intercept him. But that ain't a good uh, look. So we had him enough enough time to uh, work it out and survive his wrath. Whew. And there we go with that mystic dispersion again. And I'm like, are you kidding me? Am I going to die again? Come on. So here we go. We're, we're, we're pushing him back because we really don't want to be in that corner. Especially if he has wrath again. So you'll notice I'm doing something a little bit different. Woo! Parry heavy. Parry heavy. Parry heavy. All the way. And that's how we end in that fight. I was not playing around. Did not want to lose another AB. All right. Uh, so that was it for my participation in this war. You will never see me die that much again. I do not like dying. That was a nice learning experience. And what I learned is that I really don't want to use uh, Nebula uh, for that fight if I can help it. All right, so we're going to take a brief intermission, and you're going to find out how we did in this war. And we're back, and despite all of those deaths, we won. Now, check this out. Can you get any closer? Look at this. Look at this. This was a battle, y'all. Look at this. We won on fight duration. That's what we got them on. It actually went down to fight duration. Whew. Indian legacy. Well fought. You guys fought well. This was a battle. Okay. But we won. Had the quicker fights. But that's going to do it, guys. Thank you all for watching the video. Feel free to hit that like button if you enjoyed it. Woo! What a close war. Take care, and you all have a blessed day.